What is up guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Zach, we got another episode of The Journey coming to you today. In today's episode, we got two matches, one match in the Nathaniel MG Cup, second round against Haverford West, and then we'll come back for the league match against High St. Mary's. In between episodes, uh, we beat Mold Alex in the league 2-0. Pretty easy win. There wasn't too much to say about it. Um, Adam Jones, Jamie Breeze on the board. We looked really good. And then we made two signings. First one we made was Steven Pedrao from Mold Alex. Uh, he lost that match against us and was like, yep, screw it, I'm jumping ship. Um, brought him as a rotation player that um, I'm kind of banking on Rio Dyer not performing well. So I gave him a star player status. He wasn't going to come over unless I gave him star player, so we'll keep an eye on him. He is worse than Rio Dyer. Um, if Rio Dyer starts running into bad form, then we'll slot Steven Pedrao in there as well. He can play either side, left or right. He can also slot in as a striker or an attacking midfielder if we need it. Um, I'm hoping Adam Jones continues his good form. He had a little bit of a shaky match um, in the last episode, but that is okay. He can shake that off and move on with his life. Our other signing was Ryan Edwards, 31-year-old. We brought in from Hollywell. He's done kind of the tour in in uh, in the Welsh leagues. Been pretty much everywhere. Solid kind of backup player. Again, he wasn't going to come over unless we gave him an important player. We're only paying him five pounds a week, plus I think like three or four pounds per appearance. Um, again, really, really solid bench player. He probably has a shout to be a starter, but I'm going to try to um, let this develop. If Josh Keys just uh, doesn't cut it, then we can slot Ryan Evans there. Stats-wise, we probably should just put him in now. Actually, looking at that, we probably should start... Ryan Edwards. Midfield as just a box to box. Um, you know, it's not obvious. We'll continue with Josh Keys for now. If he doesn't work out, we'll th we'll throw in Ryan Edwards there. Let's get into this cup match. Um, that's all good. TNS beat Denby in penalties. All right, here we go. As you can see, Steven Pedrout is cup tied. Um, he made an appearance with Mold Alex, so he cannot play in the cup with us, which is fine. We are going to start Karen Evans in goal. I'm going to continue starting my backup in the cup matches. We're not going to bring a backup goalie. We can, we can only name five subs. Ryan Edwards. Um, honestly, let's bring Maloney instead of Edwards. Bring on Heath and I guess Reese Evans for the hell of it. Remove you from the position. Remove you. Um, we have plenty of options on the bench. Right, left, center back, center mid, right, left winger, and a striker. I think that should be good. We don't need to worry about U19s, but we have plenty of them. Starting lineup for today in the Nathaniel MG Cup against Haverford West at home. In goal, we have Carmen Evans, Taylor Davies, Tom Davies, Callum Winchcombe, Jamie Reynolds in defense, Riley Cotter, Josh Keyes, Manny Judd in the midfield. Rio Dyer, Adam Jones, Jamie Breeze up front. Submit the team. Come on, boys. Let's uh, let's continue our form. Shall we? Anybody we recognize? Um, probably not. Mm, nobody's jumping out at me. 
uh, I want you to pick up where you left off. Come on, boys. Haverford West starting off with the ball. Moving left to right. It's a clear day. Oh, well, I say that, and it starts drizzling just a bit. A couple raindrops in the air. Westwood in the box to Maloney. His shot is blocked. It goes out for a corner. 30 seconds into the match. They're going to play it short. Murphy. Top of the box to Edwards. First time shot goes over the bar and wide. Um, all right. Maloney with a free kick over the bar. Another goal kick. I think we are... Um, what? Why Why does it show all of the penalties? Interesting. Anyway. Reynolds over to Cotter and Judd. Top of the box, his shot. Deflects off a defender. Reynolds. Judd does well to keep the ball. That looked a little naughty to me, but... Goes out for a corner. Tenth minute. Landon Lowe's is first corner of the day. Jamie Breeze has a bruised shin. Welcome to the sport, my friend. You will be kicked in the shin once or twice. You'll get over it. Reynolds, top of the box to Keys. His shot. Yes! Josh Keys scores his first of the season. Well done, son. Landon Lowe's won. Haverford West, nil. 11th minute came from a set piece. Reynolds can't find the cross. Josh Keyes is in a little bit of space. Takes a touch. Shoots it through traffic. Phillips can't deal with it. And it hits the back of the net. 1-0 to the good guys. Haverford West are in the Premier League, I guess. Um, Welsh Premier League. So they are a decent team. Dyer. Oh, oh, bar down. Oh, hit it, get it, get it to him. Oh, come on, Manny. Into the box again. Taylor Davies can't win the header. Falls to Jamie Reynolds. Back to Davies. Dribbles backwards. Gives the ball up in the end. And we end the highlight there. Um, we're off to a good start. 141 people in attendance today. Mark Stokes, the referee. It's a gusty downpour, apparently. Um, it did not look like a downpour. From those shots. It does, I mean, I guess, yeah, it is kind of raining. You can see it now. Anyway, Maloney to Murphy. Haverford West looking to start an attack. It's a great ball to Ford. Takes the shot. Karn Evans uh, probably should have done better. At least stick your hand out and try to save it. He just kind of watches it go past him. And Haverford West draw level 30 minutes gone. Murphy with a fantastic ball and a great run from Ford. Evans just kind of... Yeah. Oops, I missed it. Let's offer some encouragement after that goal. Reynolds on a yellow. Maloney gets a yellow as well for Haverford West. Coming up to halftime. Maloney has a free kick. Top of the D is a great save from Evans. It was going in the top corner. Evans full stretch, saves it, puts it out for a corner. Murphy standing over. It's going to play it short to Maloney. Back to Murphy. First time into the box. Try to clear it. We do well. We do well enough. We'll take that. Murphy into the box. Breeze. Can't deal with it. Is headed over the bar for a goal kick. Six shots to three in favor of Haverford West. And we are at halftime. Yeah, their XG kind of skyrocketed that second stint. Um, yeah, I'm happy so far. We're, we're keeping them honest. It is 1-1 this time. Uh, this half, rather. We are going left to right. Davies with the ball gives it to Davies. Keys, chip ball over to Judd. Can't do anything with it, and we end the highlight. Jamie Reynolds standing over the corner, left-footed in swinger. Top of the six-yard box, Judd wins the header. It goes out for another corner. 
Probably should have done better with it, but we have another chance here. Reynolds standing over it again. See if we go to the same spot. We don't. We go to far post this time. Haverford West clear their lines, and we in the highlight. Let's turn on floated crosses early. Reynolds with throw gives it to Callum Winchcombe. Adam Jones to Jamie Breeze back to Jones. Reynolds once again with it. Keys in a little bit of space. Finds Manny Judd. Cotter over the top. Dyer. First time to Jamie Breeze who scores. He might have been offside. It was tight. Referee keeps the flag down. We keep the second goal. Landed those two. Haverford West one. Let's see how tight that was. That looked really, really tight. He was miles offside. He was a mile off. Hold on. We got to go back to that. Keys, Judd. I just want to see how far off he was. <laughs> Oh, we got away with that. Oh, my word. That is the point of uh, contact. <laughs> He's a good yard and a half offside. That's impressive. All right, let's watch this free kick. Maloney off the bar. Judd clears it out for a corner. I can't believe we got away with that. That was a bad one. Thompson Summers plays it back to Alvarez. Gives it out wide to Murphy in the box. Squares it. Karin Evans does well. Gathers it up. Very quickly into another highlight this time for Lanados. Keys over to Cotter. Jamie Breeze puts it into the box. It's dealt with, but not well enough. Jones to Judd. Manny Judd scores his second of the season. Assisted from Adam Jones. We're starting to walk away with this match just a little bit. We've given ourselves a nice little cushion. Good finish from Manny Judd. Land of those three, Haverford West won. Let's watch this highlight. Jamie Breeze. Dyer can't win the header. He's never going to win a header. Taylor Davies over to Cotter. Over the top trying to find Dyer again. It is cleared only to Cotter and Davies. Keys up to Jamie Breeze. In space, takes the shot off the bar. Jones to Cotter. And that was a wasted opportunity there. Uh, Riley Cotter can come. Actually, no. Let's take off Jamie Reynolds. We don't want him sent off. Let's bring on Hayden McWilliam. Confirm that sub. And we will continue with that for now. Ekinola to Murphy, dribbling forward. Looking for the cross, but pulls it back to Ekinola to Alvarez. Westwood on the left side now. Edwards dribbling forward. Cross is put in the box. I think it took a deflection. Carmen Evans does well. Grabs it out of the air. Puts it down early. Boots it real long. Jamie Breeze is in space here. Takes a touch. Takes... Oh, Jamie, bro. Dribble it past the goalie and then take the shot. Come on, man. You're better than this. Dyer. Corner kick. Looking for Davies. Can't win the header. And 
Akpolokpo. Akpolokpo. That's a tough name. Gives it to Edwards. Looking to start the counterattack. Davies does well. Intercepts that. Over the top now to Jamie Breeze. Out to Rio Dyer. Looking to get past his man. Hits the cross early. It's deflected. Phillips picks it up. Not a good pass from him. Dyer with the ball. Early shot. Probably should have done better. Probably slot Jamie Breeze into the um, penalty spot or so. Coming up to the 75th minute, we will be making another change shortly. I'm thinking Winchcombe can come off. He's been a little tired. Not the best rating out there. We'll take him off for Josh Maloney. Give him a run as center back for about 10 minutes. Um, Jamie Brees wants to come off, so we will take him off as well. As our final trick, keys Judd to Jamie Breeze. Out to Adam Jones, back to Breeze. Jones making the overlapping run. Pulls it back to McWilliam. Finds Manny Judd, early shot over the bar. Go ahead and make that final change. Stuart Heath on for Jamie Breeze. Confirm the changes. About five minutes left of the match. Should be able to see this one out. Five minutes of added time here in the second half. About two minutes left of that to go. Josh Keyes standing over the corner. Wasting time. Far post. Heath can't win the header. Adam Jones with the ball. Plays it back to Riley Cotter who is sitting fairly deep. Over the top. Looking for Stuart Heath. Can't do anything with it. Ford. Shot. Saved from Evans. Once again, a little, a little casual there. Just, yeah. Good save in the end. Thompson Summers. Puts it in the box. Rut making the run. It is cleared. Dyer standing over. Possibly the final kick of the match. Looking for Heath, wins the header. Another corner. That was a good chance. Really good save from the keeper. Dyer once again. Standing over it. We have used up all of our time. So far it is cleared in the end. That's full time. Landed Lowe's 3, Haverford West 1. We are moving on to the next round. It was a fantastic performance from the lads today. Well done, boys. All right, let's see when is the draw. It is tomorrow, so let's scooch you on over to that. Tom Davies doesn't have any interest of leaving, so that's perfect. We will hang on to him. Let's view the draw. Lanelli Town playing Carmarthen. Lantwit Major drawing against Cardiff Met Uni. Colin Bay playing Real 1879. Landelos at home versus Seven Sisters. Newtown versus Gilesfield. Pennabont versus Britain Ferry. Connors Key and Airbus UK. Finally, the New Saints against Bala. When is that match? There. All right, let's make a cut here. Let's come back for High St. Mary's in the league. We'll see you in a second. It's game day. High St. Mary's, Landon Lose in the league. Let's get to it. Double checking. I am recording. Um, let's see here. We will we'll rotate for this match a little bit. I'm not too worried about that one. So let's play a pretty full force team today. And we will bring Edwards and Pedral on the bench for us. Looks like Ryan Dixon is not fit. Who are you? One star. You can go down to the U19s. Thank you very much. 
this match here. I think we're going to go with, uh, with, with this here. Riley Cotter hasn't been playing super fantastic. Uh, but, I don't know if, uh, he hasn't had really many, too many bad games. He's had a couple here and there, 6.2, 6.3. Um, let's see, that was a loss to Bala last season. That was a loss against Flint Town last season. So, I, I, don't, I don't really know why he had some bad matches. I mean, he had a red card there. Was that a Friendly? That had to have been a friendly. Um, so, like, yeah, the 6.2. 49 passes, 43 completed. So, he's completing passes. He didn't win any of his headers. Gave up two fouls. So, I mean, I... I don't know that defensive midfielders really get that great of a... rating to begin with. But anyway, we're going to move on. We're not going to worry about it too, too much. Today's lineup... Keith Richardson in goal. I forgot his first name. Taylor Davies, Tom Davies, Callum Winchcombe, Jamie Reynolds in the defense. Riley Cotter, Josh Keys, Manny Judd in the midfield. Rio Dyer, Adam Jones, Jamie Breeze up front. Let's submit. Oh, we got to give squad numbers. Ryan Edwards, you're a central midfielder. You get the number six. Steven Pedrao, you are a winger. Let's give you the 14. Submit the team. Let's get to the match. Let's see if anybody's name sticks out from the last couple of seasons. Um, Probert, I think, was an issue for us last year. Mm, nope. Nothing, nothing too crazy is, is sticking out to me. Let's pick up where you last left off. Come on, boys. We are in the yellow kits, not the green ones. Hi, St. Mary's. Starting off with the ball. Those are interesting kits. Before we get too terribly far into the match, where do I... I always forget how to do this. I want to click on any of them. Hi, St. Mary's. Just bring me to the club, man. Those are kind of fun. I, uh, what, do, what do the actual kits look like? I see Mary's FC kit. Images? Um, I mean, if that's the actual kit, that looks really cool. I'll put a picture. Uh... Hold on. Here. Over here somewhere. I had to figure out where I was looking. Anyway, back to the match. Doesn't matter. Let's get to it. Come on, boys. We can uh, get rid of that. High St. Mary's with an early corner here. Parsons standing over it. Far post. Winchcombe does well to win the header, but it falls to McDowell. Great tackle from Winchcombe. Slides it up to Rio Dyer, who can't quite get past Stevens. We in the highlight there. Nothing too terribly bad. Let's bring up that little league table once again. Manny Judd, free kick, wasted. Waste of a free kick. Airbus UK losing to Kernerfin. If we can win this match, that'll put us top of the table because that would put us above. No, that put us level with. Uh, was that Airbus UK? 
that slid in there at the last second. Dyer with the ball. Turns around, goes forward. Gives it up to Davies. Over to Josh Keys. Cotter takes a touch, takes a shot. It's a good effort. I approve. I uh, know that was Denby who is sitting on top. If results hold, Probert looping ball. Griffiths wins the header and it puts it just wide of the post. Thirty minutes gone, two shots to three in favor of Landed Los. Well done from Richardson to grab that out of the air. Boots it up. Stevens wins the header. But we win the ball back eventually. Winchcombe, with a little bit of control, gives it to Jamie Reynolds. Finds Jamie Breeze. Gives it back to Reynolds. Bad pass to Jones. Davies dribbling forward with the ball. Jones does well to kind of stop him in his tracks. Rook now back to Stevens. Over to Probert. Looking for a cross. There's the cross. Murphy wins the header. Shea Murphy scores his second of the season. Jack Probert with the assist. High St. Mary's one. Landed those nil. Um, the second I saw he was on the other side of Davies, I knew he was going to win that header. Um, Probert. Yeah, just Davies got caught on the wrong side. Richardson probably could have done better as well. Either way, we are losing. Clear it, please. Thank you. Woof, that was a tight one there. Judd. With the ball top of the box, takes the shot just wide. I like it. Whoa. Griffiths. Over to Parsons. Up to Murphy. Great tackle from Rio Dyer. Josh Keys to Manny Judd. Jamie Breeze running ahead of him. Can't get the ball to him. Rook gets the ball back. McNamara back to Griffiths. Out to Murphy. High St. Mary's passing it around quite nicely right now. Just uh, unable to do anything about it. Probert out to Davies. Cuts back on his left. Takes the shot with his right. Gavin Davies scores his second of the season. Once again, Jack Probert with the assist. 40th minute High St. Mary's score their second of the day. Um, I don't know where Reynolds was going. Either way, we're 2 0 down. Two goals in five minutes. Not a good look at all. Um, yeah, you're better than this. Out of possession, let's uh, step up more and play a little bit more narrow. Hopefully, that'll prevent those kinds of chances. Josh Keys, Manny Judd running ahead, trying to stretch the defense a little bit. Dyer tries to get past his man. Parsons with a great tackle. Five pass it, thank you. Breeze. Adam Jones wins the header. Yes, Adam Jones scores his third of the season. Great cross from Rio Dyer. Jamie Breeze definitely should have done better with that. That was a great ball into the box. Fantastic header to beat Lewis near post. We've pulled one back. Was it 2-1 on the most dangerous scoreline? 2-0, rat. Is it 2-0 that's the most dangerous? I think it's 2-0. Anyway, doesn't matter. McNamara out to Probert. First time, awkward little cross there. Richardson grabs it. 
trying to look for a place to kick it. Ends up putting it to Jamie Breeze, but Probert has the ball here. Gives it up, Cotter. Over to Adam Jones Reynolds with it. Back to Jones. Couple teammates making runs ahead of him. Into the box, Jamie Breeze wins the header. Off the bar. Nobody's there to follow it up. Manny Judd probably should have been crashing the boards there. Um, but hey, it's all right. Reynolds, Jones, up to Judd. Jamie Breeze squares it to him. Couldn't get it to him quick enough. Reynolds, nice. Davies up to Dyer. Yes, one touch. Yes, Rio Dyer scores his first of the season. And it is a tie game. High St. Mary's 2, Landed Lowe's 2, 48th minute. Oh, what a fantastic start to the second half for us. Great ball. First time effort, slots it past the keeper. Well done, boys. Possible offside. Eh, half a yard. Well done, boys. We take those. Richardson. Jones wins the header, but gives it to Rook. Davies, the good turn. Uh, probably got away with the foul there. Corner kick incoming for High St. Mary's. Parsons standing over it, left-footed end swinger. Going to the far post, we clear our lines nicely. Rook has the ball now. McNamara up to Stevens. Barker over the top. Two guys, I guess, tackled that at the same time. That was weird. Judd looking for Breeze. Bad pass in the end. McNamara up to Rook. Good tackle from Riley Cotter. And we're starting here. Here we go, boys. Breeze. Dyer. Keep it in. Well done. Put the cross in the box. Judd. Oh, Manny. I don't know if the mic picked that up, but both of my shoulders popped. That was an odd feeling. Anyway, Parsons over to McNamara. To Murphy. Back to McNamara and Parsons. Murphy. Parsons ball over the top. Looking for Rook. It is intercepted, but we give it up pretty cheaply. Bad pass from Manny Judd. Reynolds with an awkward tackle, but... Uh, eh, no! Jay McDowell wins the header. Scores his sixth of the season. High St. Mary's. Three, landed lows to 60th minute. Not really sure what happened. I think we just kind of ran out of steam. A couple of bad passes put us in some precarious posi positions. Encouragement. Richardson not having a great game. Davies on a yellow, Reynolds on a 6.3. <laughs> Jamie Reynolds. With the shot right at the goalie. Decent effort. Dyer with the corner. Lewis grabs it out of the air. Let's take off Riley Cotter. Drop Josh Keys back. Let's bring on Ryan Edwards. And... Adam Jones is there. Steven Pedrao here. Let's see how that works. Uh, what do you prefer on the left? Winger works for me. Let's confirm. Let's get back to the match. Itchy nose as per usual. Seventy-two minutes on the clock. 
Rio Dyer up to Adam Jones to Judd. Oh, bro, I hit that first time, man. Rook steaming up the left-hand side. McDowell's shot is very wild. That was a wasted effort for them. Let's hit the early cross, maybe not. Rio Dyer. Edwards up to Adam Jones. Top of the box. Shot is just wide. Let's make another change or two. Let's take off Manny Judd for Josh Maloney. Maybe swap them around. Nope. Just kidding. Let's swap them back. Also, who's on my a yellow? Taylor Davies. Let's bring on Matthew Davies. Still not a great substitution. We do need to bring in another right back. That is something I will work on in between episodes. Let's throw on the early cross. Some encouragement and an attacking mentality. Probert wasting plenty of time. His corner's put in the box. Barker's header goes over the bar. And we get a goal kick out of all of that. 85th minute. Reynolds with a corner. A left-footed end swinger. Let's see where he's going to put it. Top of the 60-yard box. McNamara. Oh. Davies almost scores there. Reynolds. Dyer. Oh, go to that man. McDowell. I don't. I wish I had something for that. Looks like we are going to be losing this match. Um, yeah, I, I don't think we played super great. We probably did deserve to lose that. Um, yeah, we definitely should have won that based on chances created. Uh, we are sitting at fourth. That is our first loss of the season. Um, you know what? I mean, I'll take that. In all honesty, from the first handful of matches, one loss, I'm not too concerned about that. I think if we continue that throughout the season, we'll have a little bit more of an issue. Um, but where are we going to come back? Let's come back for, um... What's the, is it the, the MG Cup? Is that, is that the more prestigious one? No, it's the Welsh Cup, then MG Cup, then. Tier 2 League Cup. So let's come back for... It depends where the, uh, the next match for the JD Welsh Cup is. Um... I'm assuming it's somewhere in here. So we might come back for the next round of that and the MG Cup, possibly. I don't know. I don't really know when we're going to. We're, we're going to come back at some point. But that's where we're going to end the episode there today. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. All those fun YouTube algorithm activities. You guys know the drill by now, but I will continue to talk about it because one it's a good things to do i don't know there's a whole bunch of studies that say that asking for likes and all that actually works but it's also have it at this point so you guys are going to get it forever but thank you very much for watching as always we'll see you later <laughs>